So today we're going to be checking out this blue diamond ceramic cookware. Now this is supposed to be crazy non uh, you're not supposed to be able to get any scratches on it. It's supposed to be the best non-stick material ever. And it even has that famous uh, commercial, I don't know if you remember, where they cook the egg on it, no oil, no nothing, and it doesn't stick to the pan, not even one little bit. And that's what we're going to be taking a look at. This is their 10-inch pan. So we're going to go ahead and take this off. And this will be the first time I'm trying this. So if, if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. You know, we can't change whether it works or not. Um, the pan itself, nicely made. Okay, they have a little... Um, what looks like metal right there. So it looks like you could potentially put this in the oven. I don't know what at what temperature, um, but just an option, you know, if you're dual kicking, cooking. And let's go ahead and turn this on medium. We have our one egg right here. We're going to let the pan heat up for around a couple minutes, and then we'll go ahead and crack our egg directly on it. Okay, so now that we've let our pan heat up for a little bit, we have our egg ready. Let's go ahead and crack it on there, and let's see how this turns out. We're not going to use a spatula at all. We're just going to crack the egg in there and see if we can spin it around like it does in the commercial. Okay, so there we go. We got our egg perfectly in there. We're not going to worry about seasoning it today. Let's go ahead and just leave it as is. And now we just let it cook and we see how this turns out. Now right away, it does seem like it's, I don't know, it's interesting. I guess I don't want to touch it. It's a little hot. I will have a spatula ready just in case we do need one. We might need one just to get the, the first little bit going, but we're going to give it a few seconds to heat up here and we're going to let it cook. And then we'll see if we can swirl it around or move it, how hard it's going to be to move it around while it's cooking. Okay, so we see it cooking from the bottom. Oh, oh my gosh, look at that. That's insane. And it's not even cooked yet. That is, look how easy. Oh my gosh. Can we swirl it yet? We can't because of the top, but look at how that's coming off. That is crazy. It's like it's rubber almost. And there's no stick whatsoever. Okay. So it's not quite browned yet, but we really need to get it flipped. Like that should be our first priority. Because right now it's not the non-stick. It's that the egg can't move because the top isn't cooked. So let's go ahead and see if we can give this a quick flip. And even if it makes a mess, it's not a big deal. Not a big deal because uh, it should be an easy mess to fix. Oh my gosh, this egg did not turn out well. But on the bright side, you can definitely see the non-stick in the pan because everything is just scraping off. So I guess now we're making scrambled eggs. But regardless, you can really see how nothing is sticking to that pan while we use it. And now I guess we just scramble our eggs up and just show you how clean that pan can be. So let's go ahead and take a plate. Although this wasn't originally what we wanted, sometimes it's the best demos that uh, show out. So once you have your eggs cooked, we're gonna go ahead and put our eggs on there. You can see how that just flipped out like that. Now you have a little bit of grime on there. Now I'm wondering how easy would that be to get off if we just took our pan, we gave it a quick wipe with a paper towel. Give it a quick dump. And for the most part, yeah, everything came off. Like you can see that right there. Pretty clean. Okay, for eggs being cooked in there, very, very clean. So clearly a really awesome non-stick pan altogether. Thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you in the next one.